Three Monkeys started off uh, in a very simple form. Um, the idea was that you were a ninja, and it was a very simple call and response audio game. Um, and from there, the story just you know snowballed and became this massive thing. The scope for Three Monkeys quickly became huge. Um, and now we're in a position where we've got a fantasy RPG uh, in an audio adventure form that we think is really going to redefine what audio games can be. So Three Monkeys is an audio-only adventure game uh, whereby you have to hunt, fight uh, and solve puzzles along the way to uh, solve the quest in the game. Uh, you assume the role of Tobar who's guided by a trusty sprite who sits on your shoulder called Yoska um, and the main thing is you're trying to rid the world of the curse uh, that has taken the sun out of the sky. When Steve first came to me with the idea of the game, I, I thought to myself, you know, this is a great project to be involved with, but it, perhaps it's not something that I would play. You know, it's, it's not like my Final Fantasies and my Skyrims and all that kind of thing. But, you know, after we'd reached a point where we had a prototype and we had a playable version of the game, and I sat there and played it, all those kind of preconceptions just flew out the window. It was so cool. Never experienced anything like that before. In fact, forgot that I wasn't looking at a screen. So, yeah, really, really good something different. The, the game really sparked my imagination um, and all of the sounds made everything really vivid and clear in my mind. It made me laugh actually, yeah. I found um, the narrative was really, it made me giggle a few times. I sat there smirking to myself at some of the things the character says. I'm one of those people that like plays a lot of first person shooters. It was really refreshing to play something like that where, you know, it's so different to anything that I'd normally play. I really enjoyed it. I love sounding games and especially uh, how People have been making use of it um, these days, and you guys have done a fantastic job of um, making use of that technology of uh, three-dimensional sound. I, to be honest, I've never even really knew that audio games were around before playing Three Monkeys, um, but now I've tried it. I, I would definitely, definitely play them again. And I would definitely play. I would definitely play the full version of that back. I'll definitely look out for Kickstarter when it goes online. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The crux of the story is that the world has two warring factions and something happens that splits these factions up and plunges the world into darkness. So we call this the Solar Necrosis Curse, which literally yanks the sun out of the sky and plunges the world into complete darkness. And it's at that point that the story starts. Remember what your mentor said about firing the boat? Now's the time to use it! You're gonna need to use your sword on this guy! <laughs> nice! Great work, Toba! <laughs> Steve originally approached me and told me about the idea of the game and to be honest, like it was almost like a dream job, you know, being a gamer and like being asked for my opinion. Tobar isn't a flawed character because he's blind. Actually, it's giving him an advantage and it's empowering him. And straight from the word go, the fact that you are in darkness is not a fear factor. It's something that's going to inspire you to greatness and inspire you to win and save the world. And I think that's really exciting in terms of people's perceptions hopefully being changed about being blind. We realised that we could be doing something for the visually impaired community that would create better accessibility to gaming um, and a new gaming experience that actually we realised visual gamers, so inquisitive gamers, were really interested in seeing happen. Uh, so in terms of the journey we've really come full stretch from just creating a very small concept based game right up to the point now that we have a really ambitious kind of we're looking for AAA kind of standard audio game. Uh, in a way that possibly hasn't been done before. We've taken the game to places like Eurogamer and Launch Conference already and the reaction's just been fantastic. We really have been blown away. Um, just the, the response, the reaction across social media and, and the press has been fantastic. But that's just a small snapshot of what the, the full game is going to be. The vision for Three Monkeys is huge and I, I just can't wait to put it out there and get people playing the, the full game. I'm really looking forward to playing Three Monkeys when it's done because 
I genuinely believe that what we're creating is something that hasn't been done before. Um, and every time I play the demo, every time there's something fresh in there, gamers have an opportunity to play something that they wouldn't necessarily experience anywhere else. It's people like us who need to push these games to make sure that they come to market so that actually people can play fresh experiences. Whether you're visually impaired or not, we think this is going to be a fantastic game and something you'll really get behind. And we'd love it if you could help us make it a reality. Thanks for checking out Three Monkeys. You can find out more information on the website. And don't forget to back us on Kickstarter.